Hi. I channeled a message for one of my private groups a couple of days ago, and I feel like it was so powerful and so important to hear right now that I wanted to share it with you too. And the message is from Archangel Jophiel, who is the angel of beauty. She really helps us think more beautiful thoughts and see and find more beauty in our lives, which really leads to more joy and more gratitude in our lives. So who doesn't need a little more of that going on in our lives, right? And so an image of her came in looking so beautiful with all this rainbow energy around her. And she had the spirit of the hawk flying above her and behind her was this beautiful sunrise, really kind of like in rainbow hues again, too, just to kind of set the scene for you. And she really was calling us out kind of in a big way. And she says that many of us are getting stuck in a pattern of thinking about what's not possible rather than dreaming of what is possible. And Hawk is asking us to rise above this what is not possible place that many of us are finding ourselves stuck in. And Jophiel is asking us to take a look at these situations, maybe change we have going on in our lives, the unknown, the future, with rose-colored glasses right now. And she says that these rose-colored glasses help us see the world with a new lens of hope, with the ability to really dream up what is possible for us. And she says that so much changes for us when we allow hope in. And she says that skepticism is the enemy of hope skepticism is the enemy of dreams. And so she's asking you to allow yourself to dream, to see a different perspective, to imagine all the beautiful possibilities and places that you can go. And that allowing yourself to dream is what's needed to start to make your dreams reality. So don't hold back on hope. And so she's asking you right now to take a moment to let this hope in. She's asking you to close your eyes and to allow yourself to feel this hope now. Let it in, bask in it, and ask Archangel Jophiel to infuse this hope in your heart, in your lungs, your eyes, your ears, infuse this hope in your mouth and in your throat, in your mind. Ask her to infuse this hope all the way down to your bones and all the cells of your body, completely permeating you and infusing you in this energy of hope. And just see and feel what that changes for you allowing yourself to be hopeful for the future, be hopeful about an outcome, be hopeful about your dreams. And she's reminding you to notice when you're feeling skeptical and to take that moment to reset yourself by allowing yourself to feel hope in your dreams. Thanks for taking a moment to listen to this message today. I'll see you soon. Sending you lots of love.